Our demands are realizable and simple. We want to move money from unethical companies that invest in war occupation and genocide to ethical companies. Instead, McGill has exhausted resources and finances to repress the movement. It has taken legal action, threatened state violence, and the forced removal of the McGill community for peacefully protesting against the genocide, which has martyred over 40,000 people. 15,000 of whom are children. The courts have affirmed that it's cheaper for the McGill administration to stop going after its students through legal means and violent efforts. Instead, it's better to put their energy into divestment methods that would stop the killing of innocent children in Gaza. This comes after 19 days of the administration smearing our protest encampment with claims of anti-Semitism, unlivable conditions, 